Hey guys, this is Karthik, a digital influencer and entrepreneur, founder and director at Codelens Foundation. So guys, in the previous video of Python and Don't Ghost tutorial, we have just discussed about what is Canvas a widget in Kinter. And in this video, uh, we will going to discuss about uh, event handling in Kinter. So before getting late, let's get started. Guys, before starting the video, make sure that you have liked this video, subscribe to Codeland Dogs channel, and don't forget to follow us on Instagram, and don't forget to visit on codeland1.pythonandwear.com. So anyways, let's start the video. First of all, let's open a Visual Studio Code and create a new file. That file name is going to be event handling.py and let's close this explorer and guys in this tutorial basically we will cover kintel event handling in this scenario we are adding a quit event to our uh, quit button which currently does nothing when clicked on but it will uh, exit the gui by breaking down the uh, running process in the terminal and guys in kintel event handling is a simple is uh, is a simple as adding a command which will make into a function even through this function will we create is a basic one line function so in this let's start the video so first of all we have to import some uh, modules so first of all we have to type from kintel from kintel import star and then we have to type class window and then we have to type frame something like this and then we have to type uh, def underscore underscore in it something like this and then self and then comma master something like this is equal to none and then we have to type frame dot underscore underscore in it then we have to type self comma uh, master something like this and then self dot uh, master uh, is equal to master something like this and then self dot in it underscore window window uh, something like this not windows window and uh, let's make this capital yeah and then we have to type def def init underscore window uh, init underscore window and then we have to type self then we have to type simply self dot master then we have to type title is equal to not is equal to title something like this and let's say gui and then we have to type self dot pack then we have to type fill is equal to both and let's add a comma here and then type expand is equal to one and then guys we have to type quit button something like this quit button is equal to button then we have to type self uh, then add a comma and then type text is equal to exit something like this and let's add a comma and type a command something like this is equal to self dot client underscore uh, exit and then uh, we have to just uh, simply type quit button and then uh, we have to type uh, dot place and uh, then we have to type uh, x is equal to 0 comma y is equal to 0 and guys don't worry i will provide this source code uh, link in the description box and then we have to type def then client underscore exit and then we have to type self dot exit uh, not dot self and then here we have to type exit and after that uh, let's design the root is equal to tk something like this 
and then root dot uh, geometry then we have to type 400 x 300 and then we have to type uh, app is equal to um, window then we have to type root and then guys we have to type root dot main loop something like this and now let's run this file let's open the terminal and let's copy the file path and type uh, python and the file location and here you can see guys our GUI is successfully run and guys uh, if we click on this exit so you can see uh, it breaks the uh, terminal server and it will, close, uh, it will close the GUI so guys I hope you understand this event handling in python and guys in the next tutorial we will learn something more about python so for that uh, bye bye uh, see you later and stay tuned